Hello, my name is Theo Verney. You're watching the AU Review. Well, thanks for thanks for having us at the Great Escape. This is Thank your you. your hometown. So yep. I, normally, I would welcome you, but it's uh, uh, it's, it's you having us. I've uh, frequented this public house many a time. <laughs> <laughs> we are we are sitting in a pub in uh, yep. in Brighton right now. As uh, as plenty of music is happening around us. You know, <clears> yep. How does how does the Great Escape change the city? I mean, is it is it noticeable? You know, how many more yeah. people there are here? And- yeah, it fills up and goes crazy. It's amazing. I've had some of the silliest and craziest weekends of my life at the Great Escape. Yeah. Even <laughs> even though I only played for the first time last year, mm. I would go most years as like a younger a younger adult. And you know, what 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 are your tips for a good Great Escape? What what makes um, a good a good event for? For either, for a punter or 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 yourself as a musician, um, just go. The all the unofficial shows are always really fun, and all the late shows are really fun. Um, and sneak in some liquor. That's always good. <laughs> <laughs> That's just a general rule. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Life. Yeah, 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 for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> sneak some liquor into your life. That's right. <laughs> yeah. I like it. Better better advice has rarely uh, rarely been said. Um, <laughs> You're here uh, this year because you've got a new EP about to come out next month. Do you want to tell us about it and uh, what we can expect from it and perhaps how it kind of compares to what what people have heard from you so far? Sure. Um, It's called Brain Disease um, and it's coming out on June 8th. Um, uh, And yeah, it's the first record I've had other people playing on. So my drummer, John, is now playing drums on it. And I've just generally stepped up my game a little bit with production and songwriting. Um, uh, Oh, I like this song. It's nice. (laughs) Um, uh, Yeah, so I've really, I felt like I've really stepped it up quite a lot. And um, uh, yeah, it's... I'm looking forward to getting it out to be honest I've had the the songs written for about two years so I've kind of I've written a lot of songs and they're the kind of cream of the crop as it were um so I'm really happy with it I feel it's a strong EP all the way through and it's coming out on Mount Olympus recordings on nice heavyweight red vinyl because I'm into that kind of thing (laughs) <laughs> Love it. Yeah. With uh, you, you said there were these songs were two years in the making. Did yeah. you record the album all at once? No, no, no. I'm. Uh, I kind of. I've had them demoed and written, and I've been playing them live for a while, so they've kind of been road tested. Mm. Um, and so I, just, I chose all my favourite songs that I've had for a while, and then recently recorded them with mm. some new equipment that I bought. Um, got some new microphones, produced it all myself, recorded it all myself, mixed it myself. Um, so yeah, it's a good step up for me, and so it's a little, it's a little mere, little bit more polished, mm-hmm. a little heavier than my previous stuff, and a little bit tighter, and sounds like a real record to, to me. <laughs> and you mentioned that you're using for the first time your your live the, the live people yeah. you work with. You know, so, yeah. So that must mean it's kind of very natural in its. It, it, jumping from the stage to the record and then back to the stage again all that yeah sort of we natural. we know the songs back to front so yeah. we get to work on the real intricacies when we're recording and that translates back to the live show which is really nice just tiny little things that probably people don't even notice but you know a h- open hi-hat here and stuff like that and it's just really satisfying those tiny little things <laughs> that really kind of make a difference to a live band after the greatest, <clears throat> well, first of all, how many shows are you doing here at the Great Escape? Um, I'm playing three. I'm playing all unofficial shows. I'm playing one tonight at 10:55 at Bleach, which is a great venue. Then playing on Sat, I'm playing two shows on Saturday, one um, uh, for the Republican Music and one at the Pav Tav. Yeah. And I imagine we'll get a we'll get a good dose of uh, the new EP. Yeah, I play all the songs off it. Yeah, yeah. so. It's nice. I'm looking forward to getting the EP out so people know the songs a little bit better because previously, as I say, I've been playing them for about a year now. So it's nice to have people knowing them. <laughs> yeah, definitely. <laughs> after uh, after the Great Escape, um, you released the record and then you exactly. on the road. Um, uh, nothing kind of concrete planned yet. I've got a couple of festivals playing Dot to Dot Festival, playing Gold Sound Festival. All like super good lineups. So that like with all my mates. So it's really nice. Yeah. 
with with the Great Escape being being your hometown, there yeah. must be a few a few other of your mates playing this. Oh yeah, well. yeah, gang are playing. Morning Smoke are playing. I'm really um, they're not my mates, but I'm hoping to see Wand. I don't know if you've checked those guys out. Really heavy, really heavy, kind of very fuzzy, stonery stuff. This kind of up my street. Sounds good to me. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll uh, we'll try and check those guys out. And, yeah. Um, uh, looking ahead, hopefully, uh, hopefully one day you bring your music to Australia. Oh, I'd love to, man. Um, a lot of my good friends have moved to. Uh, well, a lot of my good friends have taken gap years on Australia and never come back. Yeah. So, <laughs> I'm kind of imagining it to be kind of like here, but with better weather because it's a misery right now outside. <laughs> it was beautiful yesterday. So yeah. yeah. You have the one day a year where it's, that's, that's nice and. Seems, yeah. seems it's already happened. Yeah, it's done. It's over now. Let's talk again in a year. Yeah. <laughs> well, mate, thank you very much for your time. No, thank you, man.